everyone, I'm Colleen with Awaken Catholic and this is Awaken the Saint. Holiness doesn't have an age requirement, and old age is not a condition for courage, nor does it determine wisdom. So it was with St. Prisca, who was only 13 years old when she chose to be baptized a Christian in spite of the pagan culture of Rome. Born into a noble Roman family, it can be assumed that Prisca enjoyed a comfortable life. But during the reign of Claudius II, Christianity was being persecuted, and many chose to practice their faith in secret. Shortly after Prisca's baptism, she was found out and dragged before the emperor, who ordered her to offer a sacrifice to the sun god Apollo. When she refused, she was beaten and sent to prison. Shortly after, they released her, under the assumption that she would think twice about practicing Christianity again. However, this young saint would not be diminished, and she remained openly faithful to Jesus Christ. Thus, she was imprisoned a second time and endured flogging as well as being covered in boiling tallow or animal fat. After this, she was sent to the amphitheater where she was thrown into the lion's den. But instead of being rushed upon by the hungry lion, it instead walked up gently to her and laid down at her feet. Her life, which was detested by the Roman mob, was miraculously spared by a wild beast. But this only made Rome more determined to break her. Taken to another prison, she was starved for three days, tortured on the rack, and thrown onto a burning pile. Through all of this, she still miraculously survived. Finally, she was sentenced to death by the sword, and while on the Via Ostiensis between Rome and Ostia, Prisca was beheaded. Her body was recovered by fellow Christians who buried her in the catacomb of St. Priscilla, who shares her same feast day. Sometimes I think we get caught up in the trap of thinking we will have all these years to make ourselves holier and that sainthood is in the distant future. But holiness does not depend on years spent in piety. It comes from the courage to do God's will in your life. St. Prisca was only 13 years old, a mere child when she chose to do God's will in her life, even though it meant certain suffering. Her courageous story reminds me of a quote by G.K. Chesterton. Courage is almost a contradiction in terms. It means a strong desire to live, taking the form of a readiness to die. He that will lose his life, the same shall save it, is not a piece of mysticism for saints and heroes. It is a piece of everyday advice. He must seek his life in a spirit of furious indifference to it. He must desire life like water and yet drink death like wine. Do we love God enough to drink the cup he has placed before us? I encourage you to take a moment and reflect on the ways that he is calling you to courageously die to yourself today. Find the little moments in your life where he wants you to surrender to him. May we, like the young Prisca, find the courage to live fearlessly for Jesus, especially when we are tempted to give up. St. Prisca of Rome, pray for us. Thank you for tuning in to Awaken the Saint. Awaken the Saint is made in partnership by Spoke Street Media and Awaken Catholic. For more podcasts, visit spokestreet.com.